Yesterday, when the polling parties started moving, there were heavy showers in many of the districts. And that created a lot of problems in transportation, considering that many of our areas in the, dist areas in the districts, the road condition is not so good. So quite a few polling parties reached the polling stations very late. The polling stations, they had decided as observers and that way they were deployed. Then about 13,000 polling personals were also deployed for doing election duties. And if I include the police personnel also, CAPF including police, then more than 47,000 police personnel were deployed across the state. Now coming to the incidents, in the morning, at around 5.40, p.m. in Tijit constituency, 41 Tijit constituency, at polling station number 20, there was an incident where a crude bomb was hurled. And because of that, one person got injuries. Now, this didn't happen exactly in the polling station room. It was adjoining to the polling station room, and the polling had not started. They were polling parties were just preparing for starting the mock poll. Then another incident occurred in this Akuloto town, in Zunubato 31 Akuloto town, where there was a clash between uh, two rival political groups. There was firing also. And in that firing, one person died. The person's name uh, is, uh, I'm told, is Mr. Kebika. And uh, afterwards, a lot of forces were sent there. And uh, when situation was normalized, there also polling was conducted. And polling got concluded also leave unless the VVPAT is retrieved.